Hey, hey, welcome back to Undefined Therapy. And today we're going to be talking about the benefits of a morning routine. Just that, ha, ah, well, <clears throat> excuse me, y'all don't, you know, I wasn't blessed with the singing voice. But what I was blessed with is good therapeutic skills that I'm about to tell y'all about right now. So let's jump on into this. Now, what is a morning routine? A routine is like a schedule, something that you have set up, something that you follow, and in the morning is when you wake up. Well, maybe not when you wake up, because some people wake up at nighttime, because they're on like a weird sleeping schedule. But that's neither here. Like from 6 a.m. to like 9 a.m., 10 a.m., that's the morning. So when you put the morning time when you wake up, well, when most people wake up, and then you put a schedule or a set of things that you do in a particular order, you have your morning routine. Boom. So why do I want to talk about a morning routine? Why? Because I think it's really slap on. I think that people think that a morning routine has to be very cumbersome, very detailed, and they be like, I don't got time for that. I don't got time for that. But that's why we're making this video because you need to make time. You need to make time. Having a morning routine can help you overcome procrastination. It can help you overcome stress, all those things. And we are about to get all into it right now well well actually before if this is your first time on this channel and you like these type of mental health videos don't forget to subscribe i post videos two to three times a week so let's think about joining now we're going to talk about those benefits so the mental health advantages are that you feel a lot more mentally stable so when you're procrastinating or when you wake up and you're always thinking about what you forgot or what you have to do and that's like the first thing on your mind that can really just take your mental health, whether that's anxiety, depression, through the roof. But creating a schedule can help you feel a lot more organized, a lot more prepared, and it could really just make those cumbersome and just daunting tasks that you have to do have more perspective and could just help you just enjoy life a lot more because you don't feel all over the place and scattered. Some of the physical benefits of creating a morning routine, because when you create that routine, like you have a lot more energy, you have a lot more focus. And when you're scheduling things, you can also add in that time to do some cardio, to do some yoga, to do some meditating. And that can just be pouring into yourself more physically and more healthily because you scheduled that time. And so it's like, okay, wait a minute. Like my body has gotten this jump start. It's not just like, slugging away that's not what's happening you're like okay yeah like who got that heart pumping i'm ready to go like yes those energies are on 10 now and it just helps you be a lot more prepared mentally and physically now the spiritual rewards are that you become more one more centered with yourself i know that sounds real like you know, Mr. Miyagi or Obi-Wan Kenobi, you know, name those movies if you know those movies down in the comments down below. If you know those movies, those lines, leave them down. I'd love to be interested in how many people know that. But yes, when you're taking the time to have the routine in the morning, you can schedule time with yourself. You can schedule time for meditation, for journaling that will give you more perspective about yourself, help you realize what may be going on, increase your insight. And then if you have your insight and you're like, you know what, today I just can't do that, you know because you took the time to know it. And it just helps you just feel a lot more at peace. In addition to the spiritual reward, and you don't have to call it spiritual, insightful rewards, you have more quality time. So when you're taking the time to create your morning routine, you're also adding in self-care. That's making sure you shower, making sure you brush your teeth. You've already done a little bit of exercise or yoga. You've done your journaling. So you've had that alone time, that quiet place of peace, because we know that once you leave that door, you have all these demands. You have all these things you have to do. And when you weren't doing that before, they were taking over, man. Like you was waking up like, oh, my gosh, all these emails. Ah! Like it was becoming too much. And then when you come home, you're too tired. I'll be doing a video on the evening routine, but this is about the morning. And so you have that quality time to care for yourself, to add self-care, to do what you need to do to gear up for the day. Now, I love this one. If I ain't get you about the quality and the journaling and the mental, everybody wants to be more productive. Everybody wants to be more productive and focus more. Did you know? Studies show that your willpower, yep, your willpower and your focus is at an all-time high in the morning, like at an all-time high. 
So if you're going to overcome a problem or really think about situations that it's going to come in the morning. And so when you have that morning routine and you need to answer emails or you need to just get prepared for the day, that's the best time because your willpower, you ready to go. I mean, you ready to take on the world. So that's why if you create that time and you give yourself that time to decompress and solve anything that you need, you're like using that much more. Well, you're doing that much more, but it doesn't require a lot of energy because it's already at an all-time high. You get that? You get that? You do more with less energy so you feel better and more productive and you can focus more on other things throughout the day. And lastly, it can lead to structure and success. Now, what does that mean? Yes, successful people. If you read a lot now, I mean, this was going into another avenue, but if you want to be successful at something, it really does start with your interpersonal relationship with yourself and understanding. So having that structure where you know what you need to do, what you have to do can give you a sense of understanding so you can be more accomplished because you now know that, hey, I've gotten these things done. I feel good about myself, which registers as success. It doesn't set you up for failure by being unproductive, by feeling lazy, and then you're feeling guilty, and then you're wondering why your life is going down the drain. That's a little bit deep. But when you set yourself up for those mornings and you're feeling good, it's 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 setting you up. Like I said, it's giving you direction for giving yourself purpose, for giving yourself a roadmap to setting up all the things that you need to do, which at the end of the day leads you to being more accomplished. So using a morning routine just sets you up for accomplishing the things that you want to do while still being grounded, while still being calm. You ain't gonna always be calm, but while being calm and by giving back to yourself. There you have it. That was some benefits of creating a morning routine. Don't worry, I will be doing a video on my morning routine of how I add some of these things in my life. And I'll also have a worksheet for you guys. So stay tuned for those you don't want to miss out. So definitely hit that subscribe button. But I hope that these were helpful because you can only go as far as your personal development. And so if you're taking the time in the morning to give a piece back to yourself every day, you're only going to keep getting more aware, getting more healthier and overcoming and accomplishing those things that you want to do. I genuinely want you to win, like genuinely. Yes, definitely take some thought about some of these things that I've shared. Think about creating one for yourself. Create a sample one. Let me know all about it. And yeah, if you like these type of videos, then I definitely encourage you to subscribe. Don't forget to like this video before you head on out of here. I'm Rashonda Carey. This is a mental health channel, and I make videos to help you create your own path toward healthiness, and I'll see you next time.